This gaping hole here on Flatlands Avenue was shooting out water. The fire chief on scene says it was a water main break that caused a fountain taller than these trees. Chopper 12 over the scene earlier today. It took about an hour for the Department of Environmental Protection to shut the water off. And in that time, concerned neighbors here watched as water flowed down the street, stopping traffic and breaking off chunks in the road. Officials say the break did not affect residents' water flow, and the residents here say they have not seen a change in water pressure in their home, but they still couldn't believe their eyes. Oh, I was sitting in the room and we heard a big boom. So then my niece called and told us to look out the window. That's when we looked out the window and we seen the water. I'd never seen anything like this before in my life. This is unbelievable. The fire chief says no one was hurt and the road should be back open about tomorrow morning. And he warns that neighbors here could see power outages as repairs are made. In the Spring Creek Towers, Ali Bauman, News 12, Brooklyn. The Department of Environmental Protection is black topping Flatlands Avenue right behind me here where a main water break burst through the road. They say they still haven't determined what caused the fountain of gushing water that brought residents out here to stare in disbelief. This is what residents of the Spring Creek Towers could see from their windows at around 4 p.m. on Friday. I've never seen anything like this before in my life. This is unbelievable. I saw the actual street had blown up in the middle and the water's just shooting, like I said, about 10 stories high. I've never seen anything like this in my life. Chopper 12 overhead after what neighbors describe as a loud boom that drew a crowd on Flatlands Avenue near Pennsylvania Avenue. I was like, what is that? I didn't, I couldn't imagine. I've never seen, I've lived here 20 something years. Never have I seen, I, I didn't know what it could be. The fire chief on scene says it was a water main break. It's a heavily trafficked street, vibrations, age, time, you know, it, it over the city, it happens more often than you might think. It took about an hour for the Department of Environmental Protection to shut the water off. Officials say the break did not affect residents' water flow. Has been no collateral damage outside of the water main break. All the uh, utilities are, are in place. No loss of services, no compromise to the electric system, no compromise to the gas distribution system. The fire chief says that neighbors here could see some power outages as repairs are being made here, but traffic should be back open as early as Saturday morning. At Spring Creek Towers, Allie Bauman, News 12 Brooklyn. All right.